The hidden teachings of Jesus have been a subject of intrigue and curiosity for many throughout history. While much of his message is familiar, passed down through centuries of scripture and spiritual study, there are certain deeper, more esoteric aspects that remain less spoken of. These teachings, if understood, can help activate what is known as the higher self, the part of us that is closely connected to the divine. The higher self is not separate from us but rather a part of our being that transcends the limitations of the physical world, helping us connect to a greater awareness of life's meaning. Jesus often spoke in parables, using metaphors and stories that carried multiple layers of meaning. While his surface teachings focused on love, compassion, and humility, he also hinted at profound spiritual principles that could awaken one's inner potential. In these teachings, Jesus was not only addressing human beings as they are but also offering guidance on how to rise above the ego and connect with the divine presence that exists within us all. This connection to the higher self allows us to experience life from a place of wisdom, peace, and true purpose. One of the most significant messages that Jesus imparted is the idea that the kingdom of God is within. This phrase is key to understanding how to activate the higher self. When Jesus said, the kingdom of God is within you, he was not pointing to an external place but to an inner reality. This profound teaching reveals that spiritual fulfillment and connection to the divine are not achieved through external actions alone but through inner awakening. By looking within, we can discover the vast, limitless potential that lies in our own consciousness. To access the higher self, it is important to first silence the noise of the outer world. Jesus often retreated to quiet places to pray, demonstrating the value of solitude and introspection. In today's fast-paced world, this practice is more relevant than ever. It is in moments of stillness that we can hear the quiet voice of our higher self, the part of us that is connected to divine wisdom. This voice is often drowned out by the demands of daily life, but through meditation, prayer, and contemplation, we can reconnect with it and begin to live from a place of deeper awareness. Another key teaching of Jesus that aligns with activating the higher self is the concept of faith. Jesus spoke of faith as a powerful force that can move mountains. This is not just a metaphor for physical feats but a deeper understanding of the power of belief and intention. When we have faith in the divine and in the higher aspects of ourselves, we align with a higher vibration, one that transcends fear, doubt, and limitation. This faith allows us to see beyond the surface of things and tap into the divine flow of life. Forgiveness is another essential aspect of Jesus' teachings that plays a significant role in activating the higher self. Jesus emphasized the importance of forgiveness, not just as a moral principle but as a means of freeing ourselves from the burdens of resentment and anger. These lower emotions weigh us down and keep us from connecting with our higher nature. By practicing forgiveness, we release the hold that these emotions have on us, allowing us to experience more peace and joy. This state of being is where the higher self thrives, unburdened by negativity and open to divine love. Love, as taught by Jesus, is also a central key to awakening the higher self. Jesus spoke of love as the greatest commandment, encouraging us to love others as we love ourselves. This teaching points to the interconnectedness of all life and the truth that when we love others, we are also loving the divine within them. This love is not just emotional affection but a recognition of the divine spark that resides in every being. When we live from this understanding, we are living from our higher self, guided by love, compassion, and unity. Jesus also alluded to the importance of self-awareness and self-mastery. His teachings encouraged individuals to look at their own actions, thoughts, and intentions, and to align them with higher principles. This process of self-reflection is crucial in activating the higher self. By becoming aware of our lower tendencies, such as pride, greed, or anger, we can consciously choose to rise above them and live in alignment with our divine nature. This inner work is challenging, but it is essential for spiritual growth. One of the more hidden aspects of Jesus' teachings is the idea of transformation through suffering. Jesus spoke of carrying one's cross, a symbol of the trials and challenges we face in life. However, 
he also showed that through these difficulties, we can experience profound spiritual growth. When we face adversity with grace and faith, we are given the opportunity to transcend our lower selves and activate the higher self. This transformation is not about avoiding pain but rather about using it as a catalyst for spiritual awakening. Jesus' resurrection is perhaps the ultimate symbol of the higher self. Through his death and resurrection, Jesus demonstrated that life is not confined to the physical body and that our true essence is eternal. This is a powerful reminder that we are spiritual beings having a human experience, and that the limitations of the physical world do not define our true nature. By recognizing this, we can begin to live from a place of greater freedom, knowing that our higher self is eternal and connected to the divine. One key aspect to keep in mind is how often we overlook our inner power in the rush of daily life. We spend so much time focused on external goals, material success, and the approval of others that we forget the immense strength that resides within us. By turning inward, we unlock access to wisdom that cannot be gained from the outside world. It's about stepping back from the distractions and quieting the mind. The modern world is full of noise, both literal and figurative, pulling us in countless directions. But there is immense value in stillness, in taking moments throughout the day to reconnect with that quiet, inner space where our higher self can be heard. This space isn't affected by the chaos of the world or the opinions of others. It is constant, pure, and waiting for us to tune in. Through meditation, reflection, or even simple moments of mindful breathing, we open the door to profound personal growth and insight. Another crucial element to consider is the role of intention. Often, we go through life reacting to events rather than consciously choosing our responses. When we bring intention into every action and thought, we tap into a higher level of existence. Every decision we make from this place of intention is aligned with our true purpose and the higher self. It's not about perfection but about being aware of the energy we bring into each moment. Intentional living requires us to be present, not lost in the past or worrying about the future, but fully engaged with the now. To activate the higher self, we must also think of the idea of oneness. Jesus' teachings often pointed to the unity of all creation, reminding us that we are all part of the same divine source. When we see others as part of ourselves, we break down the barriers of separation that keep us from experiencing true connection with the divine. This shift in perspective allows us to live from our higher self, where love and compassion guide our actions, and fear and division have no place. The path to activating the higher self is one of inner work, faith, and love. It requires us to look beyond the material world and connect with the divine presence within. Jesus' teachings provide a roadmap for this journey, offering guidance on how to transcend the ego and live from a place of higher consciousness. By taking these hidden teachings and applying them to our lives, we can awaken to the truth of who we really are, spiritual beings connected to the infinite wisdom and love of the divine. In essence, the hidden teachings of Jesus are an invitation to remember our divine nature and to live from a place of spiritual awareness. These teachings are not about escaping the world but about transforming the way we experience it. By activating the higher self, we can navigate life with greater clarity, peace, and purpose, knowing that we are guided by a force greater than ourselves. This is the true message that Jesus came to share, one that has the power to transform not only individuals but the world as a whole. As we come to the close of this exploration, it's clear that the teachings of Jesus contain a depth that many are just beginning to uncover. His words were not just meant for the ears, but for the soul, guiding us toward the activation of our higher self. The truth is, everyone has within them the power to connect to something greater, and that realization is a powerful step toward living a life aligned with love, faith, and higher consciousness. Now, before we wrap up, if you found this message insightful and you feel like it resonates with you on a deeper level, don't forget to like this video. Your engagement means a lot and helps share this powerful content with others. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to this channel so you don't miss out on more content like this, which is designed to uplift and elevate your thinking. For those who want to continue on this path of spiritual growth, 
clicking that subscribe button is an excellent way to stay connected. It's an easy step that helps bring you more transformative insights. And, if you've gained even a small piece of wisdom today, drop a like as a sign that this message is reaching those who need it. Also, if you know someone who might benefit from these teachings, consider sharing this video with them. By subscribing, you're ensuring you'll be part of a larger conversation where we explore the hidden aspects of spirituality and personal growth. Lastly, if you're looking for more in-depth content to activate your higher self and live with purpose, subscribing will allow you to be the first to receive updates. Liking this video also helps the algorithm show this message to others on a similar path. Take that small step, and it could make a big difference for you and many others.